Hi, it's David here from DP Computing. Um, I haven't done any of these in a while, so I thought I'd do another quick teardown or quick upgrade of a laptop. This time we've got an Acer Extensor 5635, which I'm just going to open up to show you how to upgrade the memory, hard drive, Wi-Fi module, and the BIOS battery. So just before we start, just a word of warning, do the, or follow these steps at your own risk and please take anti-static precautions. So I'm just putting on my wrist strap now. And also just a plug for my YouTube channel, just check out my YouTube channel, www.youtube.com slash dpcomputing. It's got some other video teardowns or teardowns of other laptops and things. They're mainly Toshiba, but I've got some also Dell and Acer and so forth so thanks again and here we go first thing we have to do is make sure there's no power connected so make sure the power's pulled out and also the battery which is here to get the battery out we just have to slide this little clip here so the red's showing and then push this other clip to the outside of the unit and then the battery as you can see there will pop out Here's the battery, it's just a standard lithium ion battery and the model number is AS09C75. So I'll just see if we can see that there. So AS09C75, which is just listed there. Okay, now to get into the back of the unit, we've got to remove this panel here and that's got eight screws. Now, just to um, speed up this video, I've already removed all the screws, but I'll just show you the positions. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So they're just standard um, Phillips head screws. So if you can see that there, um, it just takes a small Phillips head screwdriver. So once they're all removed, there's a little catch here for your finger. So just get into there, and as you can see, it just pulls out quite easy. Now here we've got the hard drive, the Wi-Fi module, BIOS battery, memory, CPU, and that looks like it's the video um, chip. So first off, here we've got the memory, there's two slots. This one's only got one slot used, so you can put another memory chip in the top one. But if you want to remove this one, there's two little silver clips on the sides. Just pull them out and you'll see the memory module will pop up and then you can just pull it out put it back in just reverse what we did there just slide it in make sure you've got the little um, I suppose the little hole or divider there in the right spot so it just slides in and then you can clip it down don't try and force it in if you try and force it just make sure you've got the right type of memory the Wi-Fi module here just remove the two screws and it pops out uh, BIOS battery is here you just need to get a like a small flathead screwdriver and just pry it in and there it is you can see it just pops up and then just pop it back in the reverse now the hard drive itself it's held in by the two screws which we removed the face plate so we can just remove this so now you've got a little plastic tab here just pull it outwards and as well as the battery popping up I'll just pop that back in so I don't forget Um, yeah you can pull that out now the hard drive itself has got its own little caddy which is held in by two screws there and there so I'll just remove those two screws so again they're just Phillips head screws and these ones were actually silver in color whereas the ones holding the back face plate on were black so just in case you get which or which and that's just held in so therefore if you want to upgrade the hard drive put in a new SSD or whatever just need to remove that face plate off this one screw it onto the new one and then slide it back in well that's probably it for this laptop which was an Acer Extensor 5635 uh, thank you for watching and I hope to catch you next time bye for now